have everything ready for a tea party. Zoe, did you find Brooks? I found Batman. What? You invited Batman to tea party. Was it like some sugar Batman? Yes. One loves or two. I love two. Would you like some cream? Yes, please. Thank you. You're welcome, Batman. I made several cookies. Pick which one you like. <laughs> Wait a minute, you tricked me. That was definitely Play-Doh. Hey, what's your name? Zoe. Zoe, and how old are you? Three. You're three right now, but soon Zoe's gonna have a birthday, and how old are you gonna be? I'm gonna be four years old. Yeah, you are, and today you got to open your birthday present, which is a Play-Doh Kitchen Creations cookie set and some extra Play-Doh to go with it, and what are we gonna do today, Zoe? Bake cookies. Bake cookies, and then we're gonna have a tea party. Now, wait a second, what are you wearing? A super girl suit. Show me it. Look at that Supergirl cape. It's gonna be me and you for our tea party. Do you think we should invite somebody else? Yeah. Who should we invite? Brookie. Brookie. All right, let's go ahead and open it. So we have some extra Play-Doh. Oh my goodness, look at this purple one on the top, Zoe. I wonder what that is. We have the base, the cookie mixer, which clicks right here. Where does that go? This is like the bowl and it goes right here. And then this is a bag full of stuff that we will use to make the cookies. There are so many cool things in this Play-Doh set. Look at all of them. We have pink Play-Doh, brown Play-Doh, yellow Play-Doh, green Play-Doh. And this is called Play-Doh Plus, which is just actually a white type of Play-Doh. This right here, push it down, and then it squishes the cookies on top of this little yellow thing. You can change this one out right here. This is like the shape of a cookie mold with this one right here. Comes with a plate and some really cool fruit designs. A spatula that has holes at the end. Show me what this one does. It squeezes Play-Doh out of here. Cool. And this also has tons of different molds on it. You see all of these? And then it comes with these recipes right here. We're gonna start off by making some fun cookies with little molds on top of them. So we got this white Play-Doh out. It feels like cream. It does feel like cream, doesn't it? It's extra soft and fluffy. It's not as hard as most Play-Doh is. We're gonna stick it inside of here and make some cream to go inside of a cookie. All right, you think that's good enough? We're gonna squeeze it onto the plate right here. Ready, go. go ahead and cut it off with the spatula. That is gonna make such a cool piece to stick inside of our cookie. Now I'm using the brown Play-Doh. Take this off right here, and then go ahead and set it inside of one of these. Let's stick it inside of here. Push and twist. All right, Zoe, go. Okay, let's take this bowl out, peel the edges off, and let's pop this cookie out. Zoe, this is more like a cupcake. Look at that. It has a bottom in it. Wow, what an awesome cupcake. Do you want to make sprinkles? Yeah. What color sprinkles do you want to use? Pink. Hey, look, you can use this from the kitchen to roll it out. Nice, high five. Now let's take those sprinkles and lightly sprinkle them on top of the cupcake. This looks so good, Zoe. I wanna eat it right now. Can I eat it right now? It's this pretend. <gasps> Are you sure it looks so good? It's Play-Doh. Oh, wow. can't get anything past this girl. Let's set this on the baking sheet. Set it over there. Okay, Zoe, which one do you wanna make next? The monkey one. Okay, we are gonna make this monkey cupcake first. We need the green Play-Doh. And we are going to take a pinch and stick it inside of the cupcake piece right here and fill the cupcake up. And now we need some brown right here. See, right on top of the green is a brown cookie. 
awesome. Okay, we need to switch out and put this one in right here because that's gonna make it look like a cookie on the top. We push it down and then we twist until it locks into place. Make the magic happen, Zoe. Lift all the way up. Push. Ah, oh, nice. Now push. Great, okay, let's take it out. Whoa, look at this delicious looking cookie treat right here. On this side, it looks like it has chocolate chips and on this side, it just looks like a sugar cookie. I'm gonna set it right here. Let me see this one. It looks like a small cupcake, almost like a Reese's Pieces. All right, Zoe, stack the cookie on top of the cupcake. What do we need to do now, Zoe? Now it's time to add a cream. Wow, look at that cream coming out. Oh my gosh, it's everywhere. <laughs> we will go ahead and pinch this off and then let's swirl it on the top. Ready? Okay, what do we need to do next? Monkey. We need to make the monkey face. Oh, that's fun. Okay. And the banana. <gasps> You're right, and then we need to make the bananas. So he's got it started. I'll go ahead and push with my fingers. And now we are going to use this little toothpick right here. Look at that cute monkey. Okay, set him on top of his cupcake. And now we need some yellow bananas for this monkey. Go ahead and set it by the monkey. It's like a banana phone. Do you wanna make one more? No, I think this one banana is fine. All right, let's take this awesome treat and set it by the other cupcake. Two delicious cupcakes for our tea party. So next we've decided we wanna make this strawberry shortcake right here. Zoe, what colors do we need in order to do that? Green, yellow, and pink. Yep, and we also need the remaining white from in here. We are going to need one, two, three yellow cookies. Go ahead and make our three yellow cookies. Cookie number one. Cookie number two, wow. Cookie number three. Great job, Zoe. Now I need to add a cream. Put a little bit of cream right there, like this. Look at those. Now we're gonna stack them on top of each other to make it look just like this picture. Very nice, Zoe. Kinda leany, but that's okay. Now. That's a great idea. So Zoe is gonna take a pinch of green. She's gonna set it at the tip of the strawberry. And now Zoe is gonna add some pink to make the strawberry body. Now we have a special trick that we've learned to make these molds look very detailed. Take the spatula and smush it down all the way. And then when she lifts up, ta-da! All she has to do is peel the edges. Let's go ahead and set it on top of our cream cookie cake over here. Okay, Zoe wants me to make the next one by myself. Look at that strawberry. So deliciously juicy. Zoe is gonna take our treat over here. These look amazing. Okay, me and Zoe are gonna make one more, and then we are going to invite Brooks over for a tea party. We never made it those cherries. <gasps> Let's make a cookie and put a cherry on top. So Zoe's gonna use a strawberry cookie dough for this cookie. Zoe is gonna do this one because we haven't done anything with that one yet. That looks delicious. And now you want to add a cherry on top. What color should we use for the cherry? Purple. Okay, these are gonna be purple cherries. Peel the rest off. Look at that cherry. And set it on top of our pink 
cupcake cookie over here. Zoe is gonna make some green fruit now. There it is. Raspberry on top of our cookie. Look at that cute little pink berry. It's okay. a little tiny one. Set it on top. All right, go set this with the other ones. Oh, very delicious, Zoe. Okay, we're gonna make a little gingerbread cookie using the brown, and then we're going to use another color Play-Doh to make a bunny cookie. There is our little gingerbread cookie. Look at how cute that is. Oh, look at how cute it is. It has a little star on its face. Now there are so many more that we could make on this. I'm gonna make a gummy worm. All right, there is a gummy worm right there and Zoe is going to make a pink one. Oh, nice, look at that. All right, we're gonna make a whole bunch more molds and then it's time for a tea party. We have everything ready for a tea party and Zoe went to go get Brooks. Zoe, did you find Brooks? No, I didn't, but I found Batman. What? Oh my gosh, you invited Batman to tea party. All right, Batman, you can sit right here. Welcome to our tea party, Batman. Thank you. Zoe, would you go ahead and pour us some tea? Now this is real tea and it's hot, so be careful. Perfect. Would you like some sugar, Batman? Yes. One loves our two. I love two. Would you like some cream? Yes, please. Welcome, Batman. Excellent. Now I'll make some tea for myself. Now I'd like some sugar. Now for the cream. Perfect. Would you like some Play-Doh's cookies, Batman? Yes, please. I made several cookies. Pick which one you like. <laughs> Wait a minute, you tricked me. Ah, oh, that's not Batman. That's Brooks. I thought you said you couldn't find Brooks. Were you tricking me? <laughs> that you was not him. Oh my gosh. These tricksters. Here goes Brooks. Cookie. That was definitely Play-Doh. Oh yeah, duh. I told you it was Play-Doh. Oh, so the box was right in front of you. And <laughs> <laughs> some more tea. Well, this was an excellent tea party. If I was gonna eat one of these cookies because they were real, it would be this one right here because banana cream is amazing. These two are gonna continue having an excellent tea party with real tea and real sugar and real cream and not real cookies. If you have a tea set in your house, have a tea party. It's so much fun. And you know what? It doesn't matter if you're a boy or a girl. Tea parties are for everyone.